gonna do here is we're gonna do 10 pounds of burger real quick. And I'm gonna, I like to cut mine with bacon. So we've got our grinder attachment and auger and blades all fresh out of the freezer because we're gonna be adding quite a bit of fat. We're gonna cut that fat in just a little tiny bit at a time. Now you'll notice on this one, I'm gonna use my fine, my fine grinding attachment instead of my coarse grind again. You will see it works a little bit harder here. I've got all that fat in there. This thing's gonna start to warm up. One of the things that I'm gonna make sure I do periodically is fill the neck and back in here in the motor. If you let things get too hot, it'll start to sort of process your, your fats that you're trying to get into your meats and it'll slow your process down dramatically. So we've already done our first run here on the grinder. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna go ahead and get this set up, change bins and get the fine blade ready and run through a second time. Okay, so what we're gonna do here guys is we have gotten to the awesome part here where we're almost ready to enjoy some more of our wonderful meat products made from elk. And we're gonna take care of the hamburger meat that we made. Now, the first couple scoops I put in there, I'm gonna tamp down just a little tiny bit is I wanna get out air. The less air I have to fight with when I'm doing my poly bags, the better. I'm gonna put this in my stuffer. One of the things I like to do here when I do this is I'm gonna go slow and let it set. I'm gonna slide the bag down to the bottom of the nipple as I get my meat condensed down and it starts to come off right there. I'm gonna let it kind of go in and feed itself. Now, right when I get to the end, I'm gonna kick it back a full crank and slide it off the tube. That's gonna always leave me just enough at the top to run it through my gun. I have roughly two pounds of beautiful elk pork with bacon. I could go ahead and chuck this up here and I'm right at two pounds. So for any future use, any recipes I'm doing, I'm all right there at two pounds ready to go.